I'm gonna do a quick video review of the item. Give me one second because the product title for this item is extremely long. For the Limo Studio 700 Watt Photography Softbox Light Lighting Kit Photo Equipment Soft Studio Light Softbox 24 inches by 24 inches, comma, AGG 814 by Limo Studio. I'm gonna do a quick visual summary of how this item works and hopefully it helps you with your purchase today. This is one of your light stands. It has these little hooks here. You unhook them to uh, extend the light stand. That's one, that's two. It's supposed to extend to 86 inches. And here is one of your softbox, ref uh, softbox reflectors. You open it up, you can see there's a socket there for a light bulb. Uh, you place your light bulb right there like an umbrella there's their logo and this is one of the two light bulbs that comes with the kit uh, they're 85 watts they put out a good amount of light they seem very delicate so be careful treat it like a giant egg and this item here in this package this is simply the sheet that will go over your soft box this is the tripod once it's set up on the ground once again here's the hook unlock it and you can adjust the height. If you look on the side here of the soft box, you see another little lever here that you can turn. I you loosen it. Uh, this allows you to uh, tilt it only up or down, up or down. Uh, be careful if you don't remember to tighten it because then it can do this and it, maybe your whole light kit can fall down. So be careful. Make sure it's tightened. Once we tighten the soft box uh, and the light kit, now this is where we're going to place our light bulb. So we want to push this in and it's going to lock. Locked. we're gonna take one of our light bulbs and we're just gonna twist and turn it until it has a nice snug fit just turn 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 there you go now we take our white sheet or cover and this is gonna go uh, on top of our soft box or in front and it's easy to put together because it has velcro and all you have to do is match the velcro let's show you guys here as you can see there's velcro and it's pretty simple align it together and then make sure that it's sealed and this is our light box our lighting stand all set up uh, this is at its lowest height since it's at its medium height or halfway, I would say. And this is the light stand at full height, 86 inches according to the specs. And once again, just to show you an idea, give you an idea of how high this goes. This is a look at the power cord. This is how you turn on or turn off the, your lighting kit just want to click this on or off. A negative of this lighting kit is once it's fully extended you see the power cord is very short. It doesn't even reach the floor. So this is something to keep in mind uh, once you purchase this lighting kit. Another slight knock on this lighting kit is that it feels very a bit flimsy once you have everything fully extended. Uh, so you want to make sure that everything is secure. everything is locked in place make sure everything is uh, nice and tight now make sure it's not wobbly I had to use an extension cord because the power cord is too short once it's fully extended now 
let's go ahead and turn it on so you guys can take a look at what it looks like once it's on. On. Off. And this is what it looks like from the side with the lights on. So this is my living room, very spacious. Let's see what it does once I turn it on. I don't have a lot of light going on here. But as you can see, it's, uh, it's pretty spacious, but it gives a, a good amount of light. Okay, right now the audio is not going to match what I'm doing. I'm just uh, playing around just to show you guys what it would look like uh, with the light on and what it would look like without the light. But I was uh, holding the camera to myself. Let's try it again. See the difference, see the difference, see the difference. So it does a pretty good job of lighting up a, uh, a spacious living room. Uh, this is a spacious living room. Once again, it's just that light and this little, uh, little lamp light. It's about 40 watts that I have on the ground. And as you can see, it looks very dark. My face, my face is almost has a lot of shadows. But once I get this on, you see how much light it's generating. And this is only uh, one of the kits. Uh, so you get two of these lights. So if you have two, that's going to generate a lot of light. So this is just one. Uh, but yeah, as of right now, I'm using one of them now. So you guys can see I have a small lamp. And I am using one of the uh, Limo Studio soft boxes. Uh, if I wanted more light, I could put one over on this side over here. But for right now, it's late. It's like 2 a.m. So I wanted to just make a quick video showing you guys uh, how it worked and how it works for me. And I can recommend this product. It does have a few negatives, uh, but I think the positives uh, far outweigh the negatives of this kit. What are some of the negatives of this light kit? I would say the light stands are not of the best material. They can be a little flimsy, especially when you have a uh, when you have it fully extended. So you have to be careful. Make sure it's locked in place. Make sure you wherever it is you position it, just be, make sure that it is sturdy. It's not bouncing. Another thing I found is when you're putting uh, when you're arranging the soft box, make sure you tighten it and make sure it is tight. Uh, what happened to me when I didn't know it's a I forgot to tie in something and then the whole uh, Soft box it kind of like droops down and then it drags the whole lighting kit all the way down So you got to be careful to make sure your equipment doesn't get damaged uh, So that's one of the negatives another negative I found is the uh, Power cord for this uh, the, uh, This kit I have no idea why they made it so short. It is extremely short when you have it fully extended the cord is not going to reach your electrical socket because it is that short. Uh, so just keep that in mind if you buy these lighting kits. Uh, if you don't already have uh, extension cords, just remember you're probably going to have to purchase uh, you know, two extension cords for each kit. Uh, but if you already have them, then that should be uh, no issue to you. But just keep that in mind. Cord, very short. Uh, the light stand itself, it's a bit uh, flimsy at times, not very sturdy. But it is hard uh, to complain about this kit for the price. Again, it's only $73. You're getting something for under 80 bucks that's gonna give you like good lighting for your videos, uh, except for those few negatives. So I would say yes, I would recommend this kit. Uh, it's worked uh, really well for me so far, and I'm really happy with the purchase. Hopefully you found all this information helpful for you. If you were uh, wondering or curious about this product, if you found this review helpful, what you can do is under my review, just click on the yes button, uh, indicating that this review was indeed helpful for you. Thank you guys so much and peace out amigos.